woke up on the tent to try. Happy days. Let's get hiking. Alright, so setting off this morning, it's uh, half seven. I uh, looked at the forecast on my phone, it said it's pretty much guaranteed to rain from seven. So I dragged my ass out early, packed the tent up, everything quick as I could. It's all dry, happy days. That's after the battle packing up a dry tent, so happy about that. Um, gonna start walking. The uh, When I get to the coast, I'll show you how black it looks. I'm gonna get soaked today, so uh, breakfast on the go, and uh, let's get hiking. Hello donkey, come here. Good boy, good boy, he's a good boy, mm, yeah donkey spit hands. See you later donkey. So now I'm eating my breakfast left-handed because I've got donkey slobber all over my right hand. Did not think that through. So again, um, I did not think this through. Tide looks like it's coming in quickly. It's also going to rain quite heavily soon by the look of it. And that sign just said it's likely to flood. I'd best get through this section pretty sharpish. And I've got to go back anyway. Happy days. So, uh, a few miles in now, just past Porlock Weir, I think we're at the toll booth. Hang on, I'll come back. Worthy Coombe Toll Road. Seems steeper than the climb out of Minehead up through um, Colborne Woods, and um, that kept going on and on and on. Scratch my nose, edit that out. Um, as I was trying to say earlier, uh, last night, um, now start again. As I was trying to say earlier, um, I feel okay today. 
no aches in my calves or knees or shoulders. Pack feels a little bit lighter today. Didn't eat that much food, so it can't be that much lighter. Um, but I did spill a beer last night in my tent. It went all over my pub t-shirt. So now my pub t-shirt stinks of beer. But I'll only be wearing it in the pub really, so who's gonna notice? off my leg. Uh, first tick I've ever got um, and I know there's kind of a technique to doing it. You kind of have to claw it out from up and under uh, otherwise if you squeeze it um, its innards can go into you and obviously you can get Lyme disease. Uh, I'm not sure how good my tick removal technique was just then so um, I start really feeling really uh, crappy over the next few days. Probably got Lyme disease. This, I think I see an honesty shop. Let's have a look, see what goodies we've got in here. Uh, I don't do it. Milk, water, cans of Coke, chocolate, bananas. Yeah, jackpot. Walker's Honesty Calf, please give what you can, thanks. Cheers. Cup of tea, chair. Oh, I'm definitely having a break here. All the way down there. Let's go all the way up there. Decision time, either stay a purist and stay on the coast path, or uh, go and have a look at the lighthouse, which is longer. Warning, walkers are advised to take extreme care of the footpath beyond. This point is very narrow and exposed, especially in bad weather conditions. Beware of falling scree. Damn. Here we go. That is straight down.
the sound of rain on a tent. Made it before the rain. Happy about that. I think this is Camping Heaven Pub with a Thai restaurant in it. 30 seconds from the site. Okay, Sunny Ling campsite. Uh, cafe there, does breakfast. That's where I'll be in the morning. Spin around here. Outdoor seating area. There's the campsite. Just a few spots for tents, but all you need. And that building over there. Pub and Thai restaurant. Also has Sky Sports where um, I think I'll uh, go and watch England smash Spain tonight. Or at least watch England. Is the sound of 